I'm under orders to bring you to see General Hammond, sir. Never heard of him. He says it's important. It has to do with the Stargate. <laughs> Jack? Oh, going back. I think that this is a map of a, a vast network of Stargates. Stargates that are, are all over the galaxy. People, let's not fool ourselves here. This thing is both vast and dangerous, and we are so far over our heads we can barely see daylight. In the event your theories pan out, he has ordered the formation of nine teams whose duties will be to perform reconnaissance, determine threats, and if possible, to make peaceful contact with the peoples of these worlds. Your team will be designated SG-1. I'm General George Hammond, United States Air Force. Speak. Maybe even more advanced. They were called the Knox. Come. God, I love those people. Has it occurred to anyone that all we are now is robots? When we killed Ra two years ago, we set into motion a chain of events that will eventually lead to an all out attack on Earth by the ghoul. Unauthorized Stargate activation. This is a Goa'uld Zatnukatel. Right. Let's call it a Zat gun, huh? One shot hurts him, two shots kill him. The third shot... Disintegrates him. Oh, great. We're not on a planet, are we? That is correct. What's happening? We're on an attack ship headed to Earth. Dead Cohen, Java. If we can capture him, maybe we can get through to the old Scar. System lords are numbered. Request 
request permission to go in. Everything there is to know about the Tugger. He made the right call. Apparently, I'm the oldest and wisest among us. I can only see a wolf, Tonani, not a spirit. You can't see the wind either, Sam, but you know it's there. Grab my head, I passed out, I came to, we're here, we're home. There is nothing cruvis with me. Nu ani anquietas, ik quavideum. Apparently, I have lost the philatus to speak properly. That wasn't a joke. I didn't do that on purpose. Chevron 8 is locked. You have already taken the first steps towards becoming the fifth race. By some fluke of Stargate technology, we are witnessing something that the laws of physics say we can't possibly witness. We are witnessing good men die in slow motion, Captain. Disengage the start. Attention. This is Engage what you can't see, sir. Here we go, kid. I'm fairly certain that we've traveled back in time, roughly about 30 years. The dangerous foreign agents you now guard have inexplicably freed themselves.
her, sacrificed for each other, for this country, for this planet. You risk your lives every day in a way more dangerous and fantastic than any of us could have ever dreamed. Understand that I represent every person of this great nation when I salute your ongoing heroic spirit. You should be proud. Very happy to see you. Skara, you have priority control until the Goa old is removed. And congratulations. Thank you. Is that a money back if you're not completely alive guarantee? We'll talk. Bye, Ergo. You've been gone over ten hours, Major. Oh. Our core mission is to go through that gate and find technologies we can use to defend against Gould incursion. Am I right? We do not steal from friendlies. And when the Gould wipe us out because we have nothing with which to defend ourselves, I'm sure we'll all feel great about ourselves and our high moral standards. Earl O'Neill, you are out of line. Now stand down. As soon as they stop taking stuff, they're going to start taking people. and she is not someone you want to fool with if you get my dream. Bye. So this is what you have been doing these past few years. We'd like to exchange our knowledge and culture. We accept your proposition. So, I need a SPAS-12, a BF-8, 10 pounds PBX, and a USAS at the base of the Stargate in, oh, five minutes? All right, Carter, let's do it. Yeah, I think you got it. 
their technology and you're, you're taking advantage of their situation. Yes, I am, Daniel. We came here to help them. Their whole world is in flames and we're offering gasoline. How does that help? Sorry, but that just happens to be how I feel about it. What do you think? Something wrong? Oh, yeah. Two weeks ago, SG-50... We've done this. We do this every day. I am in agreement with O'Neill. All right, here's the deal. We're all stuck in a time loop of some kind. However, Teal and I seem to be the only ones who realize it. Anyway, I'm sorry, but that just happens to be how I feel about it. Look, if you guys are the only ones with memories of previous loops, then you're going to have to help me by learning and remembering. Anyway, I'm sorry, but that just happens to be how I feel about it. Anyway, I'm sorry, but that just happens to be how I feel about it. What do you think? You know the worst part about this? Every time we loop, Daniel asks me a question, and I wasn't listening the first time. Anyway, I'm sorry, but that just happens to be how I feel about it. What do you think? This. In the middle of my backswing! Daniel Jackson has been dragged off by a creature called an Unas. All right, anybody with a snake in their head, raise their hand. I think I just asked him not to kill me. We'd like to get the jump out of the plane. This does not seem wise, O'Neill! Said it was easy, not wise! Okay, I think we should duck. assume we're on board that ship. We have to tell these people what's happening. Yep. side just doesn't realize how wide the gap is. What they really need is a visual aid. AG system targeting Moscow? Are you ready, O'Neill? No. Give me a warning. I'm going to shoot you. Oh, we got an EM spike. System's overloading. What the hell do you think you're doing? Same thing you do. Only bad.
started. So you built one? Jack, would you stop? They killed two of my men! Yes, they did. You have only my word. Not enough. He speaks? Yes. That's because he's mine. You deceived me! The Russians have been pushing for more direct involvement in the Stargate program for quite some time. Carter, break out the C4. Wait, 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 wait. Conduct yourselves as though this were the real thing. You need our help. I was just about to bail you. I'm not sure I want your help. Where's Teal? He's right behind me. They appear to be amassing a few troops. I hope I'm not missing huh? That better be you, Daniel. Eleven days and sixteen hours. All life on Earth will be wiped out. You want to ride an asteroid through Earth? Yes. Carter, I can see my house. Engaging hyperdrive now. I have come with warriors of the Tari. Hi, guys. When ready, Major. This is a weapon of terror. It's made to intimidate the enemy. This is a weapon of war. It's made to kill your enemy. We found a bunch of these scattered around. I've never seen anything like them before. Do you really think the Asgard or the Tok'ra will really rush to our defense when the Gould finally decide to stomp on us? That day is coming, Colonel. Don't kid yourself. People who doomed our world now ask us to trust our lives to them. I'm gonna let Colonel Greaves take down the force field, sir. Dr. Jackson. Not good. We think his right hand was exposed to the equivalent of over eight to nine grays of neutron radiation resulting from direct contact. A full body exposure of over seven. Oh my God. You have no idea how painful this is going to get. This experiment seems to indicate the potential for great bursts of energy. They were making a bomb, sir. They're claiming Daniel tried to sabotage their research. You would deny us this technology? But I just... I wish there was another way. Oma de Sama. The unstable element they're working with emitted a pulse of energy far greater than anything I've ever believed possible. I brought this... Quadria. 
back as much as I could. Well, sir, this could be the missing link we've been looking for in terms of generating the kind of energy I believe is necessary to create a hyperspace window. Actually, I'm not entirely sure what the point of my journey so far has been. I mean, this is about being honest with yourself. You saved many without regard for your own life. Team. No one can even begin to understand what we went through together, what we mean to each other. So maybe Daniel has achieved something of great cosmic significance. I don't know. And to be honest with you, right now, I don't really care. The X301 was a modified glider. While many of the 302 systems were retro-engineered from Goa'uld technology, it is entirely human-built. So is the Titanic. Hammond is insisting SG-1 needs a socio-political nerd to offset our overwhelming coolness. They don't realize the threat that's out there. I can help them by helping you. I can also help finish what Dr. Jackson started. Jonas, I just don't see it happening. I am Anubis. I have actually been on board a Goa'uld mothership. I've seen their destructive power. We're here to rescue you. We're on a mission, you nit. I can't believe you lied to me again. It's that you lied to me again! Oh, come on, Jack. We've asked you here to inform you of a top secret operation that the United States Air Force has been operating out of Cheyenne Mountain in Colorado. It's called the Stargate Program. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Earth. You know how much it costs to keep that thing open?
What's going on? Watch your friendlies. Safety's off. Fleet target. Fleet background. Come on, boys. Have at him! I find myself once more in your game. I think it's Dr. Jackson you owe on this one. O'Neill was right about you. You are a pain in the ass. That's not our language. <sighs> yep. Oh, yeah. We're sort of like the intellectual Butch and Sundance of the SGC. Butch and Sundance got cornered and killed by the Bolivian army. You guys are into some crazy crap, man. Call me Emmett. Yes, sir. You okay? This is unbelievably boring. The United States Air Force has been sending people to other planets by means of an alien device known as the Stargate. Are you saying the lost city of the ancients is here? We came all this way just to find out that we have to go all the way back. No. Power source. to kill us. Dying doesn't work in our favor. No, Daniel. You 
have information that I need. I learned the location of the weapon that could be a threat to me and my brethren. There's replicators infiltrating the SGC right now. How can you know that? While I was in your mind, you were inside mine. You should never have told me. Sir, I wanted to talk to you about... Carter? We haven't heard from him in a week. How many times have you thought he was gone? And then he shows up. I'm sorry, but we're not having a memorial service for someone who is not dead. I'm sorry. I hate to do this to you. But I should have been dead four years ago. We have a time machine. We can go back and get the ZPM. Giza, 3000 BC. Why are you here? Excellent question. You don't know. Well, I thought I did there for a while. And then I realized I didn't. Bigger than I thought it'd be. Whoa! Whoa! Man! Bullets! Pops! It says that the Alterans named their new home Avalon and that they built many Astria Porta. Stargates. City of the Gods. Hello, I'm uh, Daniel Jacks. We do not require my faith. The bomb isn't in the building, sir. The bomb is the building. You shot me. You shot me first. I will have vengeance. <laughs> the Ori are all seen. His memories were manipulated against his will, and an innocent woman was murdered. Now, I've only worked with a guy a short period of time, but I'm pretty sure he's not going to let this one go. The multiverse theory of quantum physics posits the existence of parallel universes, an infinite number of ever-growing alternate realities that exist concurrently with our own. Tilk is family. I don't like people screwing with my family. I can't think of a better first operational mission for the Odyssey than to bring home SG-1. Attention all decks, this is Emerson. Prepare to engage hyperdrive. Back to the elevator, we're going upstairs. Oh! 
ships are planning to leave. Somewhere out there, the R.I. have a working suit. in that library that might prove to be useful. Atlantis. I am just saying the yield calculations can be extremely tricky, if not borderline impossible. You may need me. <laughs> Colonel Carter said as much. Oh, we were gonna tell him that. Fifth race, your role is clear. <laughs>